seminar is good. Uh, our impression and all the expectation from the Mozambique delegation have been, have been, have been, I mean, have been success successfully uh, clarified. I don't know if you can say that. Uh, Mozambique is a country who lives a, a lot from the the maritime transport and the safety of the, of the fishing vessel is a priority to, to, to our country. So the seminar is good. It's, it, it, it will to elevate the awareness to, to our governments to ratify it as soon as possible in order to help it enter into a force. Um, the state of fishing and the fishing community in Mozambique, uh, how would you describe it at this point? It's good. It's good. The, the, the fishing is, is part of the aquaculture activities in our country, and the government has specific policy into that, that, that kind of activity. The only thing that's missing for us to give to give them more safety is to to enhance all the fishing vessel safety uh, toward regulations, specifically for fishing vessels, because uh, it's different from the the, the other vessels. So what's missing to make the, to make the, the, the industry of fishery more sufficient, more safe, is the regulation for fishing vessels. And this Cape Town Agreement is, uh, is going to be more, so it's, it's, it will governize the government into creating those, regulators, those, those regulations which is missing. Um, Mozambique has not ratified the agreement yet, in my understanding. Um, what has held you back and what would you like to see done to the agreement in order to meet your expectations? Uh, I, I think what happened was was the this I think the follow up the follow up after the the, 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 the signature in Cape Town 2012. So we didn't have to we didn't do the follow up after that. Just we, we just started to look into the, the document again, I think it was in 2015. So we work on the draft to submit it to, to, to the Ministry of Council and to go through the right, the right, right way to ratify it. But I think it will get it more it, by the end of, by the middle or end of next year, because after that the draft is represented for the board of the minister. Then after that maybe it will go to, to the assembly to be ratified and or by the Minister of, Council of Ministers depends on how. We want to do. We do want to do it. Just finally, uh, as a maritime country, Mozambique, um, Africa on its own. In what way can it work as a collective to make this agreement implementable and effective in terms of protecting all the African countries that are maritime countries? What do we need as African countries to do? to assist this effort by the IMO, which goes back 40 years now. Yeah, I think we need to, we need to raise the awareness to all the countries, uh, uh, to all the African countries, to make them realize that how important it is. We have seen the data presented by the IMO delegation about the deaths and all the, all the setbacks they've been facing through this implementation process. So I think the, the, the major thing now is to, uh, to raise the awareness to the countries and take the message to our government to make them understand that it's a priority and we need to do it as soon as possible. Sure. Thank you very much. Thank you.